Hey, Tornado fans. We are here in beautiful Coon Rapids, Minnesota, where we're joining the game in progress. The Anoka B basketball team is taking on the Coon Rapids Cardinals. Join the game. It is 8-4 Coon or 8-4 Anoka. 13 and a half minutes in. Score was tied when I got here. Anoka scored three baskets, two of which were scored by Rick. Rick with a steal. Noka ball. Rick gets foul. <clears throat> Rick going to the free throw line. For two. Next one will be live off the rim if he doesn't get it. 8 4, 1248 remaining in the first half. And that's a good one. <clears throat> 9 4. Seven pays the price going into the bleachers to save that one. Couldn't wrap its ball. That's good. Nine six. Shot up, just wide. Called on Coon Rapids. 39 going to the free throw line. <clears throat> Braden stays out and everybody else switches off. That's one. Ten six. Actually, eleven six. I think scoreboard says ten six. But I don't think they uh, notched the free throw of Rick.
goes out. Jason throws in. Braden pots one. Are we 12 6? with a hot hand today. He's potted a couple of those. 14-6. Make that one. effect on the past the Elliot. This interception. Elliot prevents turnover. Pass picked off again. Ten. Fourteen ten. Three point attempt. Oh, just goes wide. Coon Rapids. Elka <laughs> moving the ball nicely. Three point attempt. Oh! 
close one. That's going to come back to Brayton and his nightmares tonight. Thirty-one with a big layup. Gets it a lot of air. Elliott with a breakaway. Oh, just off. Rebound. Oka owning the ball at this point. <laughs> Braden weighs his options, decide not to go for the three-pointer. Breakaway. Braden gets fouled. to the free throw line. 347 left in the half. 1410 in Oka. <clears throat> 20 comes in. Take on that one. 14-11. Lisa hangs on to the ball. Runs through on the layup. Got a nice block by Elliot on the way in. Lisa with a three-point shot. Oh! Coon Rapids recovers. <clears throat> it's foul. Coon Rapids goes to the line for two. Nope, you're good. Good, 14-12 and open. Changes of possession there. Braden lines up with the ball. That'll be Coon Rapids' ball. Going in. 
a foul at midcourt. Grand Rapids ball. 20 seconds left on the clock. <laughs> Noka players were uh, counting down a little prematurely. And the half ends. 14 12 in Oka. Coon Rapids coming back from a six point deficit. No, well, ref's putting six seconds back on the clock. We're going to play the last few seconds of the half over again. Just going to manually count off six seconds. Rapids <laughs> trying to get that last one that goes out. <laughs> Ref says the half is over. And all right, now the half ends 14 12. Second half action coming at you in a few minutes. Anthony giving a few instructions to his player. Now they're just going to warm up with a little dribbling and shooting. We are back. Second half action here at King Rapids Middle School.
for the scores. 1412 in Oka. 20 minutes of basketball left. A whole lot of basketball. This is a tight contest. Give the edge to Anoka slightly. A little bit more ball control. A little bit more time in the zone, but uh, we'll see what happens in the second half. Falcons will start out the second half. like to see the refs explaining the calls and part of teaching the kids the game. Fourteen all tie game. And Coon Rapids gets the foul. One shot. This will be live off the rim. No good. Score remains 14 all. Coon Rapids ball. <clears throat> Close to a basket. Rick with the layup. Okay, almost stole the ball back. just do not want to go in today. Rip almost with the steal. Coach Anthony uh, is getting clarification on the call. Coon Rapids goes to the free throw line 4 2. 14 all tie. That one's good. Coon Rapids goes ahead 15 14. What's up? Off the rim. Anoka retreats it. Rick with a layup. He gets two. 16 14. According to the scoreboard. Oh, nice shot. Bounced around for a little bit. <clears throat> Anoka 
a ball. 16 and a half, left and a half. Nice shot. 20 to 14. More for an Oka, twenty two fourteen. It's done just over five minutes into the half. That doesn't happen very often. Ball gets stuck. <laughs> Being middle schoolers and not NBA stars, they're not quite, oh, hero of the day. Number 56. <laughs> Coach Anthony questioning the possession of the ball, but it's kind of a moot point. Rick with a shot, he gets two more. 24-14. They've gone from trailing by one to, or tied up to 10 unanswered points. Rick, all alone, goes for the layup, and he sinks another one. 28-14, they're now up by a factor of two. For you folks at home doing math, not wanting to do math. Rick with a three point attempt. He's had the hot hand, scoring uh, two of the last three baskets. off for a rest. Twenty six fourteen, another change of possession. Can Rapids getting it back? Rebound. Oh, he almost puts that one home. In the free throw line, that goes off a Pyrenees. Yanoka ball. Called 
on the travel. White ball. <clears throat> Oka with a throw in. Falcons get the ball. Foul, it'll be an Oka ball. Jason with a fake, oh! Almost gets that one in, goes off, looks like the toe at number 31. The Anoka ball. Both teams sending in a couple of subs. for an open 28 14 and now it's a factor of two ball goes up and over the backboard can rapids ball Foul, he'll get yep, yep, yep. two throws. One twenty nine fourteen. Isa comes in. Shot for Elliot. That's live off the rim. He gets his own rebound. On 14, Noka go, er, Coon Rapids goes to the free throw line 4 2. <clears throat> Rick's mom is joining us. Hi. Nope. Just fine, just like that. 29-14. Coon Rapids sending a couple of subs in. Yeah, Vix got about 10 points. Yeah, it's had the hot hand. Yeah, he scored two before I got the camera going, and he scored another couple, so eight at least. with 
the steal. Everybody's caught out on the other side of the court. And they give it up. Seems like it. I think it's just the uh, optics of the room. There's The room's wider than the one we were in yesterday. Or on Monday. Monday? Today's Tuesday, yeah. <laughs> Rapids ball. Oh, ball goes out. crashing into the stands. Hey, we've got one viewer at home. Five and a half minutes left in the second half. It is 29-14 Nanoka leading Coon Rapids Middle School. He hadn't figured it out. This is basketball. Thirty-one fourteen. Four and a half minutes left. It's one of the few that Dane's missed. Oh, really? He's really had a hot hand. He's he's made some nice shots. Lost a viewer, gained a viewer. Four minutes remaining in the second half. 31-14. Anoka leading in B. Nipple School Ball Action. Uh, both refs, same ones from yesterday. Sure, thank you. Ginger mints brought to you by Altoids. Brought to us by Altoids. Lisa to Elliot, no mistake, he pots that one, 33-14. Braden going for three, oh, and he right. does Braden. it. Thirty-six sixteen. 
the stand corrected, 34-16. Point attempt, doesn't quite make that one. Sometimes I'm not sure whether it's a shoe squeak or a whistle. They need hockey whistles. Timeout called, probably by Coon Rapids. Remember yesterday, he handed the ball off to the little girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, he's uh, he's got a good sense of humor. He's made a couple of couple of cracks. <laughs> One forty-two remaining in the second half. Thirty-six sixteen. Anoka. Rick and two Bradens out there. No cabal. Braden with a layup all the way in. We have, uh, all of those have been going in for us today. So 38 16, minute 15 remaining. He shoots that one, 38-18. I'm running down, oh, 20 with the big steal. Braden follows him, he gets the basket, 38-20. Think Coon Rapids will get uh, two free throws. Number 20, Let's see if he can make four points out of this play. Traveling violation on white. I think Rick got a little early start. So he gets to do it over. I think he's only gonna get one here. Everybody's ready for the ball to be live off the rim. Rick comes up with it. Lobs it over to Braden. Braden's up. And that's the game. It ends 38 to 24 in Oka. This has been the first playoff game. Players lining up to shake hands. And we're just gonna wrap this one up. Game ends 38-20, you've been watching Anoka Middle School for the Arts, AMSA Basketball, Level B.